Hello friends, I'm back with a new episode of Biblia Milethi. Hope you remember where we ended in the previous episode. We paused at the coast of the colossal Red Sea. How come? Let's see what happens further. Miracle was witness at the Red Sea. Do you know? Yes. Lord instructed Moses to lift his staff and the Lord divided the sea and water formed walls on both the sides leaving a dry patch land between till the Israelites could cross the sea. The Pharaoh sent his soldiers to chase the Israelites but the sea came to its older form and drowned the soldiers. Can you tell me how did God guide the Israelites? God in a form of pillar of cloud and a pillar of fire by the night that traveled all the way and guided the Israelites. After crossing the Red Sea, the Israelites had to go through the desert of Shu. There was a river called Magaha. The water there was very bitter and undrinkable. Then the need of Israel started to murmur against Moses. Moses then asked God for help. God ordered Moses to put a piece of wood into the river, and then the Lord made it sweet and drinkable. God has never forsaken the Israelites. He guided them whenever necessary. He provided them with food to eat in the form of quails and water to drink. Are you familiar with the manna? Do you recall it? Yes, Israelites called manna. Like coriander seed, white and taste of it was like a wafer made of honey. Earlier, we saw how God turned bitter water into sweet. Who can tell me which incident took place on the rock of Horeb? Correct. Israelites were thirsty and there was no water to drink. So Lord instructed Moses to come to the rock at Horeb and strike it with his staff. And water came out from the rock. We see here how God continued to protect and guide the Israelites, or we can say, protected them under an eagle's wing. Mount Sinai. Does it remind you of something? Something that Lord gave Moses, and we are following it to date. Ah, fabulous! It's the Ten Commandments. So let's dive deeper into it and understand the commandments better. Before we start about, what are the commandments? Let's see how the commandments were given to the Israelites. The Ten Commandments were written on two tablets and given to Moses. So, what was the first commandment? Yes, I am the Lord your God. You shall have no other gods before me. What about the second? Right, you shall not make the wrongful use of the name of our Lord, our God. Who can tell me what's the third commandment? Yep, remember the Sabbath day and keep it holy. And the fourth, honor your father and your mother. What are the fifth, sixth, and the seventh commandment? Perfect, they are: you should not murder. You should not commit adultery and you should not steal. Coming to the end of commandments, what are the last three commandments? Correct. You shall not bear false witness against your neighbor, and you shall not covet your neighbor's wife and anything that belongs to them. What do you think? Did the Israelites easily accept the commandment and follow them? Moses, along with the commandments, discussed with God various openings. Of Israel. Let's see all the laws and their explanations and the progress of the Israelites to the land of Canaan in the next episode of Biblia Milethi. Don't forget to subscribe and like and hit the bell icon for notifications and more. Thank you.